Well, contractors recently found a sinkhole and other problems at a sober living apartment complex in Lafayette. As News 18's Joe Paul reports, 12 women are now displaced until renovations are finished. This is basically my last chance to get my kid back and to do better because otherwise I'm looking at prison time. Hannah Williams finds herself at a new sober living house in Lafayette after Home with Hope's Women's Recovery Center unexpectedly closed. I'm lucky enough that I found somewhere, but not a lot of the girls are having problems and they're scared. They're worried. Contractors renovating the apartment complex found more problems than anticipated, including a sinkhole in the parking lot, forcing residents to move out for safety reasons. Ran into a few more bugs than we thought. Brian Donnelly is vice president of Meridian Health Services, which owns Home with Hope. They'll be getting therapy counseling and, and that kind of thing. Uh, it's just a matter of where they will live, and, and our staff are working with them to find appropriate places. Donnelly says the home's 12 women are getting financial assistance and help finding new living arrangements. But William says that's wrong. I did this on my own. <laughs> they, uh, they told us that we needed to find a place and they're not offering any resources to help. No financial assistance as far as I know of. Um, so it's been a little bit rough. She fears some residents might leave the program and relapse. That's a big fear of mine. I mean, because I, like I said, those girls are my family. Um, we've gotten really close with each other and it really bugs me. Donnelly recognizes the closure causes added hardship. He says staff are helping in every way they can. And the urge to relapse is always there uh, and the coping skills may not be there. And so we know that this is a large stressor for these individuals and we want to uh, ramp up our support of them. Reporting in Lafayette, Joe Paul, News 18. O'Donnelly said he could not provide a timeline for when construction will be complete. He says work is expected to last for several weeks to months.